Two Dubuque parents are hoping the amputation of their young daughter's arm will keep their 18-month-old girl cancer-free. We first told you about this story a few weeks ago when the family came to UIHC in Iowa City. Doctors performed the surgery May 8th. CBS 2 News reporter Melanie Moore met the family this afternoon in Dubuque. Scott, as you may remember, Paisley was diagnosed with a rare cancer. The family tells us patients of this cancer are usually between the ages of 20 and 50. 18-month-old Paisley Chapman may have lost an arm, but her parents say she has not lost any momentum. <laughs> she runs to the door every single day, wants to go out every single day, and wants to go out, play in the park, and act, acting like a normal kid. Doctors found a malignant peripheral nerve sheath tumor in November. They removed the tumor from her left forearm, but in April the family found out the cancer came back. There's no treatment that works for it besides amputation. And I'd rather her lose her arm than her lose her life. Her parents say doctors have estimated a 30% chance of the cancer coming back elsewhere. I'm still a little scared, but looking at her every day, knowing she's happy and she's okay right now, then I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Well, yeah, they say Paisley is persevering. It hasn't slowed her down yet, and they hope it never does. The doctor told us that it's going to take her a while to get her balance down and have everything back to normal. Less than 48 hours after she was army crawling, she was up running. Paisley will have follow-up scans to make sure the cancer is gone. The family says they will maybe look into a prosthetic when she turns three or four. To learn more about Paisley's story, we have a link for you on our website, cbs2iowa.com. Melanie Moore, CBS 2 News.